Shalom, shalom, shalom. <clears throat> yeah, this is the book of Jude, verse 24. Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. <clears throat> to the only wise power, our Savior, the glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever, so be it. Giving all praises, our honor, our glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai Bahasham, Wachaha Khodash. <clears throat> and double honor to my teachers, the apostles, the elders, and the bishops of Great Millstone. Watch over our souls. Shall warm to the Yakim, worldwide in our sincere and serious doing the will of Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Wachar Khodash. Second Peter chapter 1, <clears throat> verse 1 and 2. To you all, stay strong and stay mighty. So I'm the brother, the disciple Kosha Banyamin from the branch in Great Millstone, Barbados. And these are the brothers here in um, Washington, D.C. And they want you to hear what these men got to say. Why are the evil days come not? Yeah, so it says, think about the Lord right now before the evil days come. That's what it says in layman's term. So think about doing the Lord's work now. Think about what his true name and his only begotten son name is right now. Think about repenting right now. Asking for mercy right now. They got a problem with procrastinating. Always want to wait until the very, very end to do something. See, what y'all jakes want, y'all want elections to happen and then all hell to break loose before y'all start to repent. That's a fucking problem. The Lord ain't no fire extinguishment. How many times we got to use that parable? The fire comes, now you want to bring out the tool. Now, that's not the case. He's supposed to be living inside of you. You should be a walking reflection of the ways in heaven. That's what it should be. Jesus, Lord, have mercy, man. Ooh. Let me, let me let out pray again. The problem. The Lord ain't no fire extinguishment. How many times we got to use that parable? The fire come, now you want to bring out the tool. <clears throat> now, that's not the case. He's supposed to be living inside of you. You should be a walking reflection of the ways in heaven. That's what it should be. Our people should see you and be like, oh, something is different about this dude. Right. It happens to us. It should be happening to you, too. That's right. It's a free. Yes, sir. It's the book of uh, Psalms 1. So, um, these same brothers here, I was watching these brothers yesterday, yeah. <clears throat> before he went, yeah, and, um, the brother there, the tall brother in the blue garment, he bought a preset here, which hit me so hard, right? Um, and the spirit army what come back here this morning, finish watching his brother's video here. Is that? Right? Man, I tell you, man, if 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 one of those get edified by any branch from Great Millstone, then um, y'all are just um. A persona non grata you should look it up so this preset the brother bottle here is second Corinthians chapter 4 verse 1 therefore seeing we have this ministry as we have received mercy we faint not I won't stop there because when he read that there boy um, <clears throat> That really hit hit me hard like a big rock. I ain't gonna tell you. Let me read it again. Therefore, seeing we have this ministry, what the ministry? The ministry of reconciliation. You understand? The Lord has given each and every one of us talents to go out there, right? On the highways and hedges and trade. You understand? Bring forth fruits, meat for repentance. Right? So we have this ministry as we have received mercy. But like I mentioned yesterday at camp, all we should be dead. Yeah, the brother that was reading for me, he said it first. He said, all we should be dead. All we should be dead because 
all of you breaking the Lord's laws every single day, brother. The scripture doesn't say in Romans, we have fallen short of the glory. What's the glory? Keeping these commandments to the 613 commandments, big man. We have fallen short of that. So Yahweh Shai had to step in. He had to step in. You understand? <clears throat> Redeemed us from the curse of the law, which is what? Being penalized. Working on the Shabbat, it should be penalized. Uh, committing adultery, it should be penalized. You know what I mean? Um, um, extortions, you being a faggot. All the ones in this world right now, under grace. One don't even know that because all these edgy BTQ members shouldn't be breathing right now. So everybody in this world is receiving mercy from the one on high. When I yeah, when I fucking wrong, the Lord is gonna bring back the fear in this earth. You see, we seeing and feeling the fear of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. That's in the book of Second Corinthians five and ten. Right, knowing therefore the terror of the Lord, we persuade men. So you see us up there on the highways and hedges. We tell you, listen, hey. Some serious things about to happen to this world. We paint a commodity laws umbrella. But some saying it as we harassing, we doing this, we doing that. No problem. No, you see the video that went out. What if you can find that video now, boy? Um, you know what? Who was training? They came back here. 5 p.m., 8 o'clock. I'm coming down West, West State Street. Jacksonville, Florida, downtown. I was at the 7 Eleven right there. The Hebrew Israel. I ain't seen no he I just I don't be down here during this time. Today was a long day at work. I, just, I gotta go finish. But man, I had a sighting. I saw some Hebrew Israelites at the 7 Eleven, dog. And man, it's it's a lot different than it used to be. Cause it used to be they used to just harass everybody. Like they used to harass Everybody had a purple and gold shirt. So I'm right here, right here by FSCJ, right here. They used to just harass everybody. Everybody walked past. And I remember when I was younger, I used to just avoid them, avoid eye contact, all that. Like, I'm not like that anymore. I'm the guy that I will not change the direction that I'm walking if I'm walking through Walmart and I see them fucking cell phone salesmen in the middle of Walmart trying to sell me on a new cell phone plan. I walk straight past and they look me in my face and I look them right back in their face like, don't even, <laughs> don't even come this way. There's no way you thought I came to Walmart to get a new cell phone plan for my family. There's no fucking way you thought that. So I did the same thing. Like my whole demeanor is different now. And y'all, them, them boys ain't say nothing to me. I saw a woman coming. I was literally going to go out there and walk her across the uh, parking lot to get into the, she was looking nervous. She was a black lady. She already knew. She, she was already knowing. She looked so nervous. She started her strut, and they kept, they just didn't say nothing to her. I said, these boys is learning. I fuck with it. Then a homeless guy walked past. They start arguing with him. I said, oh, my God, they know that they can only do that with crazy people now. And you, what you don't understand is that <clears throat> the spirit of the Lord, right, is the spirit of the Lord is, um, withdrawing itself you see the spirit of Yahweh Baha Hashem Yahweh Shai is withdrawing itself from unbelievers so when you say the Hebrew Israelites are learning no nah, we ain't learning we, we ain't learning when, when the prophets keep the mouth closed you don't understand that that's your damnation because we, they're giving warning Isaiah 58 verse 1 cry aloud spare not they lift up their voice like a trumpet and show my people their transgressions and the house of Jacob their sins. There's going to come a time the Lord is going to close our mouths. And then you're going to be like, oh shit, boy, what, what, what the fuck going on here? Then you're going to want to hear the word. You see? Right? So if we go back here in 2 Corinthians 4 and verse 1. Therefore, seeing we have this ministry, as we have received mercy, and we're trying to extend that mercy. That the Lord has given us unto you to call you in. You see? Because that's what the word church means. To call out all the called ones. You see? But if that voice ain't coming to your ears. If you're hearing our voice. You know what I mean? The Lord ain't calling you. The Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son is not calling you. <laughs> and that's a fearful thing. That's a fearful thing. So, me reading again, 
Therefore, seeing we have this ministry, as we have received mercy, we fear not. So us that in this truth, we should not, I should not faint. The power of faint, Lord. They say, right. we faint not. Look at this word faint, man. Strong's G, 1573. Ekakeo. 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 Bayer's lexicon. Second entry. Egg kakeo. Egg kakeo. Egg kakeo. It says, ooh. Oh, Lord. To be bad or weak. I eat to fall in heart. Many a mind. Many a mind. Faint, be weary. You can't be weary, big man. With, with this, with this truth, as we have received mercy, all we should be put to death, big man. You people breathing up there because of the law, you have a shy, big man. True as father, you have a. Yet when it's still committed dirty, when it's still bullying, when it's still extortioners, when it's still liars, perjured persons. But we that got this ministry, we should faint, big man. Fuck them people up there. It's going to say, Work on your own salvation with fear and trembling. Go there and preach this word, whether they hear or forbear. It's just that simple. Because we open, are you open for mercy, big God? As in that final, when that final curtain call comes, when the society collapses, you see the banks in Canada freezing certain accounts from people. Banks in Canada freezing certain people's accounts, big man. Huh? If you're comfortable how you pay your mortgage or pay your rent or put gas in your car or buy food. Because you're getting ready for a cashless society, a digital society to put the mark inside of you. You are going to bear, you you people out there are going to bear the devil's image. That's where you're going to take his mark. The ones that have received mercy, right, through this ministry, be hoping to bear the mark. Of Yahweh but Hashem Yahweh Shai. You hope to have that Sawa, that will be one mark in Ezekiel 9 and 4 means Sawa, which means exempt from judgment. We receive the white stone. I mean, tell you that. We may we, we receive the white stone, big man. Allah wanna got the black stone. Right? So when the feeling, when the feeling heart meaning be Jesus Christ, look at this yellow. Go hot there, boy. To be utterly spiritless, to be wearied, out, exhausted. So the key word here is to be utterly spiritless, big man. Let me get our word spiritless, boy. Let me let me get our word spiritless, big man. That means the Lord ain't dwelling in you, because the scriptures say, "He that believeth from me, as the scripture have said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water." You understand? So you're going to be a live big man and, and the, the fear will be in you and you will let these words come out to your epistles. You're studying, you're going out on the highways and hedges, big man. You're full of, you're full of life, brother. Look at this verse, spiritless, man. It's a lucky a minute, man. Spiritless. 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 Lack Jesus Christ. Lacking courage. You know the word courage means to go, go about to, to being a man. Lacking courage, vigor, or vivacity. <laughs> Ooh, Lord, depressed, downcast, or melancholy. I wrote some proper boy. It's very some powerful boy. Melancholy. 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 A feeling of pensive sadness, typically with no obvious cause. An air of melancholy. You know these demons get the better of you, brother? Huh? Have we got this truth, brother? Destination, sadness. Or you could be sad when the kingdom of heaven is at hand, brother. Now the flesh kicks in and negative thoughts but all you got to do is go back to the precepts they ever any trust in the lord was confounded that's uh, uh i think first maccabees 1 and 61 i think it is it's like gloom 
you should be like this when you first was in uh, during slavery days. I mean, you it get his feet is weird to the modern day captivity, but as you have this ministry, you're doing faint better. You understand? Because the Lord has, has given us life, big man. He's given us life, brother. So let me go back here. Let me go back here. Second Corinthians. So that can well say the spirit that is spirit. St. John 6 63. It is the spirit that quickeneth. You see that? The flesh profiteth nothing. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. So these the words the Lord has given us, this ministry has given us life. But you was once dead in big, big man. He you know the prayers of the dead is life. So you, you, one of us dead, brother. You was dead, big man. But through the mercy from Yahweh, sending his son, Yahweh Shai, now we are alive again, big man. You feel a vigor, brother? Strong's G2222. Zoe. Zoe. The state of one who is possessed of vitality or is animate. That's what this word does, brother. That's what this word does. Right? Life real and genuine, a life active and vigorous, devoted to the most a blessed in the portion, even in this world, of those who put their trust in Hamashiach, but after the resurrection to be consummated by new ascensions, among them a more perfect body and to last forever. I brought this out in a couple of videos I did earlier. Let us draw near with a true heart. So let me go back to the uh, Second Corinthians. For I want again. Therefore, seeing we have this ministry as we have received mercy, we faint not, we don't give up, but have renounced the hidden. It's like you, I don't know where that is. But have renounced the hidden things of dishonesty, not walking in craftiness, nor handling the word of the Mosai deceitfully, but with manifestation of the truth. Commending ourselves to every man's conscience in the sight of the Most High. See, commending ourselves to every man's conscience in the sight of the Most High. Let me get any NLT. Then I get shot, shot, man. This is short video, man. Real thing. Treasure in fragile clay jars. What does we? We then clear. We, 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 this, this boy, this is clear. What's that preset boy? Is, is it Job? We, yeah, or is it Hebrews? We drill in hoses are clear, brother. Uh, we have this treasure in earthen vessels. Wait a minute, boy. Uh, wait a minute, boy. Um, sorry, so like, yeah. I don't want to lose that there, boy. We have this treasure in earthen vessels, boy. Just to prove that point. Wait a minute. Treasure. In earthen vessel, come on, man. Oh, treasure we have this treasure, all right. We have this treasure. Second Corinthians four, we yeah, same the same chapter. Shake man, the same chapter. This is Second Corinthians four and seven. But we have this treasure in earthen vessels that the excellency of the power may be of the Mosai and not of us. See, so we got this treasure right in these fragile bodies, big man. Treasure in fragile clear jars. This is New Living Translation, same chapter. Second Corinthians four and one. Therefore, since God in his mercy have given us this new way, we never give up. We reject all shameful deeds and underhanded methods 
we don't try to trick anyone or distort the word of God. We tell the truth before the Mosai and all who are honest know this. See? If the good news we preach is hidden behind a veil, it is hidden only from people who are perishing. Ooh, God. Yeah, boy. So, so it's J here. You see, like this J here. You don't hear any word no more, quote unquote, Hebrew Israel is learning. Listen, big man. You about to perish, so the spirit ain't wanting you no more. The spirit was wanting the homeless man. It wasn't wanting the woman that you was trying to save. It done the wanna. It done the wanna. Cause it only looking for the elect. It's like so yeah man, I can close there. Kahala Yahoo Bashimia was shy. Shalom.